Hello friends welcome back to YouTube channel Beautiful Victory today is 13th August 2022 it is 19th week in ordinary time in this video you will get to know about the saint of the day gospel reflection and quote of the day in the end saint of the day saints hippolytus and pontius martyrs pontius governed the church from 230 to 235 hippolytus a priest and a person of some importance in the church in rome at the beginning of the 3rd century provoked a schism which lasted for some years in 235 during the persecution of christians in the reign of the emperor maximinus they were exiled to the mines of sardinia Pontius was beaten to death with sticks and Hippolytus died for the faith in 235 Gospel reflection from Matthew chapter 19 verses 13 to 15 In today's gospel loving parents wanted to bring their children to Jesus for if he would bless them pray for them and place his hands on them then surely those children would be protected and healed and blessed which parent wouldn't want to for they had seen the amazing things jesus had done for others in fact jesus himself had talked about letting children come to him then why would the disciples of jesus stop them they might have felt that the master's time will be wasted in talking to small children however jesus rebuked his disciples for their attitude towards those children he told the disciples that little children are what the reign of god is all about in today's world many of us do not allow children to participate in the church's activity and sacraments for they give more importance to worldly things and not heavenly things in this regard the readings of the day tell us that we are responsible for evangelizing our children god views children as important in his kingdom children are the future of the lord's church as jesus dearest ones we ought to respect and teach good values to them let us ask these questions to ourselves do we block children nearing to jesus like his disciples did do we bring children near to jesus Do we help them to get blessing from Jesus through the sacraments and by breaking word of God accurately? We quite often hear of more horrible instances of child neglect, child abuse, child trafficking, child labor, abortion, etc. In this society, what's our attitude towards these instances? Do we fight for their rights? If we are silent in these instances we are working against his kingdom let us pray and practice lord help us help the young children walk in your way and bless them with good health of mind and body jesus we trust in you amen quote of the day happiness is not something we postpone for the future whereas it is something we design for the present thank you friends